A preschooler's ability to learn letters is largely determined by their engagement. Many studies have shown that multisensory learning is the way to go. Here's what my multisensory letter table for the letter W looks like this week. We use mini pieces of chalk to help students use the tripod grasp. They're going to practice capital and lowercase w on this handwriting without tears chalkboard. Then I use a baby wipe to erase. Next, my students are obsessed with learning how to spell watermelon with this awesome song that we sing. W-A-T-E-R-M-E-L-O-N. What's that spell? Watermelon. I'll try to find and share that song in another video. So in this tray, students are copying the word watermelon. The next tray is my newest obsession. I just saw one of my fellow preschool content creators make a video on this and I was so excited. I love glitter, but you can't touch it because it's so messy. So I dumped glitter and they're going to use a paintbrush to write the letter in the glitter. And then you just shake the tray to erase. I'll tag that creator below, make sure you go follow her. Make sure you give your students explicit instructions for this, that they are not allowed to touch it. The only thing that touches it is the paintbrush. Next, the students are going to use the whisper phone as they trace the letter W. If they forget the sound, they can press this button. W says W. I taped these sand cards down to the tray so that they wouldn't move when the student is holding the phone in one hand and tracing with the other. This really is the coolest thing because when you put one side to your ear and you whisper in the other, you can hear it very clearly even in a loud room. This activity is trace, erase, try. Students will trace the letter W, erase it, and then try it on their own. When I have students tracing in a sensory material, I always put a letter card right next to it. This way students have a visual right next to their writing material. I teach my students that when they're writing, they need to be saying it. This way they're seeing it, hearing it, and touching it. And last but not least, we have our letter W hunt and find. We use these small crayons from Handwriting Without Tears again to help with the grip. Students can color the letter W and find all of the W's on the page.